Good morning. It's time for Selichot Sparks. Today, I want to provide you with another interpretation of the words Anshe Emuna Avadu, this time in the context of protecting Klal Israel. Sometimes, God forbid, evil decrees fall on the Jewish people. When the tzaddik, who is alive, sees these decrees and how they're affecting his people, he begins to ask for mercy from Hashem to annul the Gezera. And simply out of pure respect for the tzaddik who prayed, Hashem listens and cancels it. The problem is, when the laymen know that there's a tzaddik who can do this, that there's a tzaddik who's protecting them, they entrust that he will just pray whenever things go wrong. and They'll never do teshuvah. Why should I repent? Whenever something bad happens, this rabbi or this baba is going to pray for us. By not repenting, the people are deserving of punishment. And Hashem removes the tzaddik from the world in order that he doesn't protect the people. These tzaddikim had the ability to be doche et gezerot, to push off and push away the decrees. But once our sins pile up and we choose not to repent, merov avonenu avadnum ne'esfu menu enu. We lose. We lose them. We lose the tzaddikim. And now... It's simply up to us to change the outcome.